Hey guys, I just want to show you today this new laser that I got in the mail. This is a 100 milliwatt laser beam green laser that I got from Laser uh, website online. Uh, I actually got it because this is basically just a hobby. You know, this isn't something serious or, you know, I've researched and thousands of people collect laser beams in the, the hundreds of dollars and this one wasn't too expensive, but uh, which is why I got this one. Um, so I'm just going to do a little demonstration of it. This is definitely something more powerful than you'll see at uh, you know your store or something you play with your cats with. This is not something to to mess around with. As you see, it's got the typical danger sticker on there because um, it is it is dangerous uh, if you point at eyes or anything like that, or even if you stare at it close up, um, it does start to affect your eyes. This one I got is the 100 milliwatt from Laser. Um, this is what came in the mail. Uh, it's actually kind of a big unit. Uh, the string, as you can see, it's starting to fray a little bit. Um, so it's, you know, not something that I'm going to keep on there. Uh, it does come with a key on it. And you can go ahead and turn it on or off. There's two keys. Uh, right now it's in the on position, but you can turn it off for safety purposes. It's got a nice standard handle, little button, your standard danger sticker. And the tip of it, you can actually focus it. If you open it all the way up, as you can see there, now it's going to be a wider beam, uh, but I have it focused all the way down to be the smallest beam possible. Uh, I'm going to show you what it can do, um, and I'm going to take it outside and show you what it looks like at night. So here i got some black tape, electrical tape. Um, that's the beam. Like I said, it's a pretty, pretty powerful beam. Um, and on black tape, anything black, um, you know, if you get a match or something and you paint it black, um, or here, like I got black tape, uh, it actually starts to light it on fire. And as you can see, it's starting to smoke. This is if you give it, you know, if you do it just right, you focus it just right, and you're just the right amount of distance away from it. As you can see though, it is starting to smoke. This pops balloons, I haven't tried that yet. Um, lighting a match is a little bit harder to do. But actually it's probably not going to work very well right here because I've been doing this all day. Maybe a little better on this side. Starting in the corners works really good. And this is the 100 milliwatt. Anything over 50 will do this. Um, this actually came with a power certificate of 102. Uh, each one they test to certify the power of it. So this one actually came out to be 102, so you get a little bit more, uh, which actually doesn't make too too big of a difference. As you can see, though, it was starting to... I've been playing with it all day, so it was actually eating away at the tape. So let's go outside and see what this looks like at night. We're going to go into the field next door. Let's see if it makes any dent in the snow. Nothing. Wow. Don't live in the Midwest because you get all this snow. Alright, as you can see, it's nighttime out. So I'm not playing. Got my beam out here. I don't know if it's not easy to see. But this is actually going pretty far. And there is a constant stream of light. You can't really see it though because of the camera, but there's actually a beam that you can physically see that sticks all the way out there. And this thing shines pretty far. This is about a two mile radius, radius that you can see it from. And this field next storm shining it, this is probably 
I don't know how long that is. It's probably a quarter mile to that light right there. A quarter mile to a half a mile to that light. And it's shining down there pretty accurately. There's a sign across the street. And the beam is perfectly, perfectly visible. So these things are not meant to, to mess around with, you know. You know, again, it's just a hobby tool, but, uh, you know, not too, not a very expensive hobby, but something cool. Like I said, people spend hundreds of dollars on these things, but not me. This is it for me. They make blue, red, green, purple I've seen. Uh, I like the green, though. You better can't see the beam. So you can, there you go, you can see it right there. At night, obviously, it works best. But that's it. Just a quick little video of my little laser that I got from Laser. Again, this is the 100 milliwatt. I also got a, a battery, rechargeable battery with it, and a charging station for it. Yeah, that's it. I'll try and post a video soon of me popping balloons if I go out and buy balloons. But yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching.